I was just in my office, and I heard a ruckus. What in God's name is going on in here? Well, if you mean the terrorists, sir, we don't exactly know. We haven't heard a peep from them. Why is that door closed? Who closed that door? We don't know that either, sir. He won't give us his name. But he appears to be the one who phoned in the report. He's killed one terrorist for sure, and he claims he's capped off two others. He claims? Oh, I'm sure that's exactly what you want these people to believe. You think this is cute? You think he's bitching? Is that it? I don't think so, sir. In fact, I think he's a cop. I'm sorry to inform you, you're going to be without his services for the rest of the day. The TV's here. Son of a bitch. Go up to the escalator. Yeah, that's where they're going. Yeah, they're going to go, go through ahead. the Tell lobby, me. up there, and try and draw some... What's fire. going on? We are going to write an essay. Man, that's crazy. There could be over 30 hostages in there for all we know. Grab some wood there, bub. What do you think? I was born yesterday. You ought to spend a little more time trying to do something with yourself and a little less time trying to impress people. You might be better off. Excuse me, sir! Yeah. But what about the body that fell out the window? I'll give you the answer to that question next Saturday. Okay, we're all set. We're ready. Hakanaga! Go! What was that ruckus? Our spotters say you got two with that blast. What was that? Give it to me, Bender. Go, get back in your seat. That's the last time you ever make me look bad in front of those kids. Do you hear me? I make $31,000 a year, and I've got a home, and I'm not about to throw it away on some punk like you. The false alarm you pulled Friday. False alarms are really funny, aren't they? You're not fooling anybody, Bender. The next screw that falls out is going to be you. Oh, you're in charge. Well, I got some bad news for you, Dwayne. From up here, it doesn't look like you're in charge of jack shit. What's the matter, John? You're gonna cry? What is that? What? What is that? What is that noise? All right, girls. That's 30 minutes for lunch. If he gave himself up, they'd both be dead right now. You think anybody is gonna take your word over mine? I'm a man of respect around here. They love me around here. I'm a swell guy. You're a lion sack of shit, and everybody knows it. Are you going to stand there and tell me that he's going to give a damn about what you do to him if he makes it out of there alive? Why don't you wake up and smell what you're shoveling? You just bought yourself another Saturday, mister. I've got you for the rest of your natural-born life if you don't watch your step. No, sir. You couldn't drag me away. It is now 7.06. This is Hans Gruber. I assume you realize the futility of direct action against me. We have no wish for further loss of life. Don't mess with the bull, young man. You'll get the horns. I have comrades in arms around the world languishing in prison. In Canada, the five imprisoned leaders of Liberté de Québec. In Sri Lanka, the nine members of the Asian Dawn. What the fuck? You have two hours to comply. Now, I may not have caught you in the act this time, but you can bet I will. The next time I have to come in here, I'm cracking skulls. Hello? Hello? Danny, did you get all that? I will not be made a fool of. My office is right across that hall. Any monkey business is ill-advised. Yeah, sir, the FBI is here. Oh, you stay out of it. Are you through? Yes, sir, right over there. Hold this. You want a breath, man? Aren't you forgetting something? Such as? What about John McClain? He's the reason why we have the information we have up until now. He's also the reason why you're facing seven terrorists instead of 12. He's inside? Who is he? Well, he's a bum, a gutless turd. One of yours? Carl, don't be a goof. Yeah, Central? Yeah? Uh, yeah, this is Walt uh, down at Nakatomi. Uh, say, listen, uh, would it be possible for you to turn off uh, Grid 212? The wise guy here has taken it upon himself to go to the gymnasium.
That was not the noise I was talking about. Shut up, Pee Wee. You got yourself a good man. You take good care of him. Get on your feet, pal. Let's find out how tough you are. I want to know right now how tough you are. Come on, I'll give you the first punch. Let's go. Well, well, here we are. <laughs>